guys, today we are going to learn about metamorphosis. What is metamorphosis? Now I can explain that. Metamorphosis is the process of changing shape for an animal. You can say, suppose you are looking at a butterfly. Now the butterfly is an egg. Then the butterfly becomes a larva, which is called a caterpillar. And now that caterpillar looks very different from the real butterflies that you see. They just inch and inch and eat and eat. So that's all they do, basically. Until they form into a chrysalis. Then they start spinning. They have start spinning a covering around themselves so that they can have some protection while they are becoming a butterfly. When the but when the caterpillar comes out of the chrysalis, it becomes a but it is a butterfly now. Then that butterfly will climb up a stalk of the plant that it used, and then dry up its wings, and then it will fly off. But what did you notice? The caterpillar was very different from the butterfly. So, the process of changing shape because the caterpillar was just an inchworm when it was born, and now it is a very elegant butterfly. So the process of changing shape, metamorphosis, happened with the caterpillar. And you can also take a ladybug's life cycle. Same way, it starts with an egg, and then it becomes a larva, or a tiny ladybug, except for it looks more like an inchworm. Then it becomes a pupa, and then after that, it becomes a little ladybug, just how you see them now. Now, we can look onto a frog. You see, frogs are very, uh, frogs are very familiar animals. So, you can, not, you can learn their life cycle easily. So they does start with an egg in a, in a um, clump of jelly under the water. Because they um, live both on land and water. So, then the little eggs become tadpoles. And those tadpoles keep um, swimming throughout the water. Some of them could be eaten by predators. Then, those tadpoles become um, young, um, like froglets. So, froglets have those tiny little legs in the back. No legs in the front. And they still have that tail. And slowly, the tail shrinks. And then it um, goes away. And then... The frog grows its two front legs and then it can hop onto land and it can live on land and water. So those are the three cycles of metamorphosis I wanted to discuss with you. As you can see, the tiny babies were very different from the forms they take when they are adults. So that is called the process of changing shape because they change shape when they were a pupa. For a frog, a froglet, and for a butterfly, a chrysalis, and from for a ladybug, we just call it a pupa. And that's all we wanted. I wanted to discuss with you today. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for more educational videos. Bye.